Krill's face suddenly became transparent, and the blood vessels and bones in his hands were clearly visible, when he raised his hand. A passerby, offered him a bottle of water, and Krill drank it, but that didn't solve the problem. Krill got out of the car weakly, and the kind-hearted man, helped Krill aside. After entering the city center, Krill gradually recovered. Krill is a talented programmer, who has not married a wife in his, 3-0-S. Krill recently had a fight with his girlfriend Anna. In order to make Anna happy, Krill hid in a Russian doll. But Anna was speechless, it turned out that yesterday was Anna's birthday. Before leaving, Anna told Krill that she already has a new boyfriend and should not pester her, anymore. When Krill returned to the company, he received a warm welcome, and everyone was cheering for Krill. The game developed by Krill sent, the company's stock soaring, and Krill became a rising star in the company. Now the beauties in the company are all around. But Krill was very, dedicated and asked his friends to send him home after the celebration. Krill opens the door to find a strange woman, Renata, in his home. Krill, politely let Renata out. Renata told Krill to go out instead. They called the police to intervene, and the police told them to open the door first, but Krill was stunned by the sight of the house. It was my own home just now, but now it has changed the decoration. Could it be that Krill is, hallucinating? At this moment, Renata took out the real estate certificate, and the apartment was indeed in Renata's name. Krill wanted to take away, the dog he had raised for many years, but the dog didn't recognize him. With nowhere to go, Krill came to a friend's house. He found his, information on the internet, and everything was normal. So he went to City Hall the next day, ready to claim his own house. But there is no, information about Krill in the official network, as if Krill has never lived here. Krill came to the company, and now his colleague Rosa doesn't, know him anymore. Krill took Rosa's cell phone, and wanted to find the group photo from yesterday, but there was only Rosa in the photo. So Krill, called out the names of all his colleagues, but everyone still didn't know Krill. Krill went to his father Kapkov again, and Kapkov said he had no, son. But Krill suddenly felt something was wrong, why everyone didn't remember him. But good friends still remember. This wardrobe can make any wish, come true. Krill stared at the cabinet thinking about something in his heart, and Renata turned out to be naked. Krill finds Renata, hoping to learn the truth from Renata. Renata didn't answer Krill's question, but mocked that Krill has nothing now. Angrily, Krill picked up the fruit knife, and pretended to stab Renata. Unexpectedly, Renata held the knife instead, and sent it into her body. Renata was not, breathing and Krill was so scared that he wanted to flee the scene. Unexpectedly, Renata's neighbor appeared at this time and knocked Krill, unconscious. When Krill woke up again, Krill had already sat in the police car. But the police let Krill go. He also found that there was an, additional address in the phone. Krill followed the navigation to the tower, which was in a state of disrepair, and there was a tattered mattress. Krill had nowhere to go anyway, so he fell asleep here. When Krill woke up the next day, the room was changed again. The wooden floors are also laid, automatically. Renata who died yesterday unexpectedly appeared. Renata tells Krill that the tower is a hub for teleportation between parallel worlds, and that Krill is the chosen gatekeeper. Responsible for transporting people from all over the world every day. Here, Krill can get, what he wants, Krill just found Renata unreasonable. Renata went to the closet and asked Krill to say her wish silently. After Renata left, Krill found that his, body seemed to be different. Looking at the water being manipulated wantonly, Krill panicked. Krill opened the door, the place is still in the, original place, but the season has become completely different, really came to a parallel world. Krill also had no choice but to accept his job as, gatekeeper. Different people come to the tower every day, and Krill's job is to check people who cross the border. Today, a man and a woman are, crossing the border, and the woman among them is Krill's ex-girlfriend Anna. However Anna no longer knew Krill. Seeing the back of Anna leaving, Krill felt very sad inside, and he decided to leave the tower. Krill and Tarasov came to the church, suddenly the Matryoshka robot appeared and, attacked them. But Krill is not the same Krill he used to be. Krill dodges the robot's shots, Krill takes out a sword. Tarasov recorded all of, Krill's movements. Suddenly there was blood dripping on the mobile phone, and the blood dripped from Vasilisa's body. Vasilisa, covered in blood, asked for a large vat of water. As the water was drank by Vasilisa, Vasilisa's body returned to normal. It turns out that they are the gatekeepers guarding the nodes of the parallel world. They got what they wanted and gained great power. Even if it is, fatally injured, as long as there is water, it can be restored to its original state. But the price is to lose their identity from now on. Krill is, not content to stay in the tower forever. Renata decided to punish Krill after discovering that Krill had gone to another world secretly. Krill, puts on the pendant Renata gave him, and the pendant turns into a mechanical spider. After wearing the pendant, Krill can only move within 15, kilometers of the tower. Once the 15 kilometers had passed, Krill's body would melt. Krill got on the subway, and as the distance got farther and, farther away, Krill's skin began to become transparent, and there was pain in his chest. Krill got out of the car quickly, and the kind-hearted, people passing by took Krill back to the city center. With nowhere to go, Krill found Anna. Even though Anna no longer knew Krill, at least Krill, could still make friends with Anna? Krill takes Anna on a trip to various worlds, and the two become close again. 
but Krill's behavior crossed the line. As a gatekeeper, you should no longer have entanglements with ordinary people. Anna was caught by the committee and thrown into another world. Krill finds Anna in a broken world, but the gatekeeper here is unwilling to let her go. The Guardian is the leader of all the gatekeepers and Krill took Anna back to the tower. At this time Tarasov came to the door, and it turned out that Tarasov was Krill's guardian. After Krill was chosen to be the gatekeeper, only Tarasov recognized Krill. As a punishment, Krill's range of motion is reduced to 50 meters around the tower. But, it is not safe for Anna to stay in the tower, and the committee will liquidate Anna at any time. Krill carried Anna into a sunny world. As Krill approached the 50 meter limit regime, his body was about to disappear. Just then, Anna woke up. Regardless of being stabbed in the palm of the hand, Anna desperately took off the pendant. Krill is now out of restricted form. After taking off the pendant, Renata came to find him. A fight started between the two, and Renata's rights took control of the world tower. But Krill is also a powerful gatekeeper. During the stalemate of the battle, Krill drew out his dagger and killed Renata. As the battle ended, the world tower collapsed. Krill gets a call from his mother. The collapse of the world tower also allowed Krill to regain his identity. The loud sound attracted the fire brigade, and under the watering of the water gun, Renata's body recovered. Krill's story is not over yet, whether Renata can stop Krill, and whether Krill can get Anna back.